Welcome to Book Buzz Reviews and Summaries. Imagine standing at the threshold of a transformative moment in your career, a moment where passing the PMP exam could be the key to unlocking a world of opportunities, higher earning potential, and the respect that comes with being a certified project management professional. But, as you approach this milestone, the daunting task of preparing for one of the most challenging professional exams looms ahead. The PMP exam is notorious for its complexity, breadth, and the level of commitment it demands. Yet, this book, PMP Exam Prep, Rapid Learning to Pass PMI's PMP Exam on Your First Try, by Rita Mulcahy, is here to change the narrative. Rita Mulcahy isn't just an author, she's a seasoned project manager, trainer, and mentor who understands the pressures and challenges you face. She knows that the journey to PMP certification is as much about mindset and strategy as it is about mastering the material. And with this book, she offers you a lifeline, a comprehensive, no-nonsense guide designed to help you conquer the exam with confidence and efficiency. What sets this book apart from countless other PMP prep resources is Mulcahy's unique approach to rapid learning. She recognizes that most professionals preparing for the PMP exam are juggling demanding jobs, personal commitments, and the stress of absorbing an overwhelming amount of information. That's why she doesn't just offer pages of dry content. Instead, she delivers a well-structured, engaging, and laser-focused study plan that zeroes in on what you really need to know to pass the exam on your first attempt. Mulcahy's method isn't about cramming or memorizing, it's about truly understanding the concepts and applying them in a way that sticks. Through her innovative techniques, such as RMC's famous Tricks of the Trade, you'll learn how to navigate the exam's most challenging questions with ease. She breaks down complex topics into manageable chunks, using real-world examples and practical insights that make the content relatable and easier to grasp. Her approach demystifies the PMBOK guide, transforming it from a dense, intimidating textbook into a practical tool for your success. But Mulcahy's book offers more than just content mastery. It's a complete exam preparation system that includes proven study strategies, test-taking tips, and mental preparation techniques. She understands that passing the PMP exam isn't just about knowing the material, it's about staying calm, focused, and confident under pressure. With this book, you'll not only learn the material, you'll also learn how to manage your time effectively during the exam, how to approach different types of questions, and how to avoid common pitfalls that could derail your success. From the very first page, Mulcahy speaks directly to you, the aspiring PMP. She empowers you to believe that passing the exam on your first try isn't just a possibility, it's an expectation. Her guidance is personal, practical, and rooted in years of experience helping thousands of professionals just like you achieve their PMP certification dreams. As you embark on your PMP journey with this book in hand, you'll feel a sense of reassurance and motivation. You'll know that you're not just studying for an exam, you're preparing to elevate your career to new heights. Rita Mulcahy's PMP exam prep is more than a study guide, it's your trusted companion, guiding you every step of the way towards success, fulfillment, and the professional recognition you deserve. Introduction, Navigating the PMP Exam with Rita Mulcahy's Guide Project Management Professional, PMP, certification is one of the most sought-after credentials in the project management industry. Preparing for the PMP exam can be daunting given the vast amount of information one needs to absorb. Enter PMP Exam Prep, Rapid Learning to Pass PMI's PMP Exam on Your First Try by Rita Mulcahy, a book that has become synonymous with PMP exam preparation. Mulcahy's Guide is not just another exam prep book, it's a comprehensive tool designed to equip candidates with the knowledge, strategies, and confidence to tackle the exam and succeed. This review delves into the core aspects of Mulcahy's book, examining its structure, content, and pedagogical approach. We'll explore how the book addresses the needs of PMP aspirants, the effectiveness of its learning techniques, and how it compares to other resources. Whether you're a seasoned project manager or new to the field, this review will provide a detailed look at why PMP exam prep has become an indispensable resource for exam success. Chapter 1 Introduction to the PMP Exam The opening chapter of Mulcahy's book sets the stage for the journey ahead. Mulcahy doesn't just dive into the content, 
she begins by addressing the psychological and emotional challenges associated with preparing for the PMP exam. She acknowledges the stress and anxiety that many candidates feel, especially when faced with the overwhelming amount of material to study. This empathetic approach immediately connects with readers, making them feel understood and supported. Mulcahy then provides a high-level overview of the PMP exam, including its structure, the types of questions to expect, and the scoring methodology. She emphasizes the importance of understanding the PMI, Project Management Institute, mindset and how the exam tests not just knowledge, but also the application of project management principles in real-world scenarios. One of the key strengths of this chapter is Mulcahy's focus on the importance of a study plan. She provides practical advice on how to create a personalized study schedule that aligns with one's learning style, availability, and other commitments. The chapter also introduces the concept of rapid learning, a method that Mulcahy advocates throughout the book. This approach is designed to help candidates quickly grasp key concepts and retain information, making the study process more efficient and less overwhelming. Chapter 2 Framework and Fundamentals in the second chapter, Mulcahy dives into the fundamentals of project management, covering the core concepts that form the foundation of the PMP exam. This chapter is crucial because it establishes the groundwork for understanding the more complex topics that follow. Mulcahy's approach to teaching these fundamentals is both systematic and engaging. She doesn't just present information, she breaks it down into digestible pieces, using analogies, real-world examples, and visual aids to help readers internalize the concepts. For instance, when explaining the project life cycle, Mulcahy compares it to a relay race, where each phase represents a leg of the race, and the project manager is the coach who ensures that the baton, the project, is passed smoothly from one phase to the next. The chapter also covers the different types of organizational structures and their impact on project management. Mulcahy's explanations are clear and concise, making it easy for readers to understand how different structures influence project roles, responsibilities, and communication channels. The use of case studies further reinforces these concepts, providing readers with practical examples of how they are applied in real-world projects. Chapter 3 – Integration Management Integration management is the glue that holds a project together, and Mulcahy treats it as such in this chapter. She delves into the processes involved in coordinating all aspects of a project, from initiation to closure. What makes this chapter particularly effective is Mulcahy's emphasis on the interconnectedness of project processes. She highlights how decisions made in one area of a project can have ripple effects on other areas, a concept that is crucial for PMP candidates to grasp. Mulcahy introduces tools and techniques for effective integration management such as Project Management Information Systems, PMIS, Change Control Systems, and Project Management Plans. Her explanations are thorough, yet accessible, making complex topics easier to understand. The chapter also includes sample questions that mimic the style and difficulty of those found on the PMP exam, allowing readers to test their understanding and identify areas where they may need further study. Chapter 4. Scope Management Scope management is a critical component of project success, and Mulcahy dedicates this chapter to exploring its nuances. She begins by defining the scope and explaining its importance in setting the boundaries of a project. Mulcahy then walks readers through the processes involved in scope management, including planning, defining, validating, and controlling scope. What sets this chapter apart is Mulcahy's focus on the real-world challenges of scope management such as scope creep and stakeholder management. She provides practical strategies for managing these challenges, drawing on her extensive experience as a project manager. The chapter also emphasizes the importance of a well-defined scope statement and the role it plays in preventing misunderstandings and conflicts later in the project. Mulcahy's use of diagrams and flowcharts is particularly helpful in this chapter, as they visually represent the flow of processes and the relationships between them. The chapter concludes with a set of practice questions, complete with detailed explanations of the correct answers. This reinforces the learning and helps readers gauge their understanding of the material. Chapter 5, Time Management 
Time management is often one of the most challenging aspects of project management, and Mulcahy tackles it head-on in this chapter. She covers the processes involved in developing and managing a project schedule, including defining activities, sequencing them, estimating durations, and monitoring and controlling the schedule. Mulcahy's approach to teaching time management is both practical and relatable. She uses real-life examples to illustrate common scheduling challenges, such as delays, resource constraints, and changes in project scope. Her explanations of tools like Gantt charts, network diagrams, and critical path method, CPM, are clear and easy to follow, making it easier for readers to apply these tools in their own projects. One of the highlights of this chapter is Mulcahy's discussion of time management best practices. She offers valuable tips for staying on track, such as breaking down tasks into smaller, manageable chunks, regularly reviewing and updating the schedule, and using buffer times to account for uncertainties. The chapter also includes a comprehensive set of practice questions, complete with explanations, to help readers solidify their understanding of the concepts. Chapter 6 Cost Management Cost management is another area where PMP candidates often struggle but Mulcahy makes it accessible in this chapter. She begins by explaining the importance of cost management in ensuring that a project is completed within budget. Mulcahy then walks readers through the processes of cost estimation, budgeting, and control, providing practical tips and techniques along the way. One of the strengths of this chapter is Mulcahy's ability to demystify complex concepts like earned value management, EVM. She breaks down the formulas and explains how to interpret the results, making it easier for readers to apply EVM in their own projects. Mulcahy also discusses the common pitfalls of cost management, such as underestimating costs and failing to account for risks, and offers strategies for avoiding these pitfalls. The chapter is packed with practice questions that reflect the types of cost management questions found on the PMP exam. Mulcahy's detailed explanations of the correct answers help readers understand not just the what, but also the why, behind the answers. This reinforces the learning and helps readers build confidence in their ability to tackle cost management questions on the exam. Chapter 7 Quality Management Quality management is essential to delivering a successful project, and Mulcahy dedicates this chapter to exploring its principles and practices. She begins by defining quality and explaining its importance in meeting stakeholder expectations. Mulcahy then walks readers through the processes of quality planning, quality assurance, and quality control, providing practical tips and techniques along the way. One of the highlights of this chapter is Mulcahy's discussion of quality management tools, such as control charts, cause and effect diagrams, and Pareto analysis. She explains how these tools can be used to monitor and improve project quality, making it easier for readers to apply them in their own projects. Mulcahy also discusses the role of continuous improvement in quality management, emphasizing the importance of regularly reviewing and updating quality processes to ensure that they remain effective. The chapter concludes with a set of practice questions that reflect the types of quality management questions found on the PMP exam. Mulcahy's detailed explanations of the correct answers help readers understand the underlying principles of quality management and how to apply them in real-world scenarios. Chapter 8 – Human Resource Management Human resource management is a key component of project success, and Mulcahy dedicates this chapter to exploring its principles and practices. She begins by defining the role of the project manager in managing the project team and explaining the importance of effective team management in achieving project objectives. Mulcahy then walks readers through the processes of human resource planning, acquiring the project team, developing the project team, and managing the project team. One of the strengths of this chapter is Mulcahy's focus on the real-world challenges of human resource management, such as managing team dynamics, resolving conflicts, and motivating team members. She provides practical strategies for addressing these challenges, drawing on her extensive experience as a project manager. Mulcahy also discusses the role of leadership in human resource management, emphasizing the importance of effective communication, delegation, and decision-making. The chapter is packed with practice questions that reflect the types of human resource management questions found on the PMP exam. 
Mulcahy's detailed explanations of the correct answers help readers understand the underlying principles of human resource management and how to apply them in real-world scenarios. Chapter 9. Communications Management Effective communication is crucial to project success, and Mulcahy dedicates this chapter to exploring the principles and practices of communications management. She begins by defining the role of communication in project management and explaining the importance of effective communication in achieving project objectives. Mulcahy then walks readers through the processes of communication planning, information distribution, performance reporting, and stakeholder management. One of the highlights of this chapter is Mulcahy's discussion of communication tools and techniques, such as communication channels, feedback loops, and information distribution methods. She explains how these tools can be used to facilitate effective communication and ensure that stakeholders are kept informed throughout the project. Mulcahy also discusses the role of cultural and organizational factors in communication, emphasizing the importance of adapting communication strategies to suit the needs of different stakeholders. The chapter concludes with a set of practice questions that reflect the types of communications management questions found on the PMP exam. Mulcahy's detailed explanations of the correct answers help readers understand the underlying principles of communications management and how to apply them in real-world scenarios. Chapter 10, Risk Management Risk management is a critical component of project success, and Mulcahy dedicates this chapter to exploring its principles and practices. She begins by defining the role of risk management in project management and explaining the importance of proactive risk management in achieving project objectives. Mulcahy then walks readers through the processes of risk identification, risk analysis, risk response planning, and risk monitoring and control. One of the strengths of this chapter is Mulcahy's focus on the real-world challenges of risk management, such as identifying potential risks, assessing their impact, and developing effective risk response strategies. She provides practical strategies for addressing these challenges, drawing on her extensive experience as a project manager. Mulcahy also discusses the role of risk management tools, such as risk registers, risk matrices, and risk response plans, in facilitating effective risk management. The chapter is packed with practice questions that reflect the types of risk management questions found on the PMP exam. Mulcahy's detailed explanations of the correct answers help readers understand the underlying principles of risk management and how to apply them in real-world scenarios. Chapter 11, Procurement Management Procurement management is a key component of project success, and Mulcahy dedicates this chapter to exploring its principles and practices. She begins by defining the role of procurement management in project management and explaining the importance of effective procurement management in achieving project objectives. Mulcahy then walks readers through the processes of procurement planning, solicitation, source selection, contract administration, and contract closure. One of the highlights of this chapter is Mulcahy's discussion of procurement management tools and techniques, such as procurement statements of work, procurement documents, contract types, and negotiation strategies. She explains how these tools can be used to facilitate effective procurement management and ensure that project objectives are met. Mulcahy also discusses the role of legal and ethical considerations in procurement management, emphasizing the importance of adhering to industry standards and best practices. The chapter concludes with a set of practice questions that reflect the types of procurement management questions found on the PMP exam. Mulcahy's detailed explanations of the correct answers help readers understand the underlying principles of procurement management and how to apply them in real-world scenarios. Chapter 12, Stakeholder Management Stakeholder management is essential to delivering a successful project, and Mulcahy dedicates this chapter to exploring its principles and practices. She begins by defining the role of stakeholder management in project management and explaining the importance of effective stakeholder management in achieving project objectives. Mulcahy then walks readers through the processes of stakeholder identification, stakeholder engagement, stakeholder communication, and stakeholder management. One of the highlights of this chapter is Mulcahy's discussion of stakeholder management tools and techniques, such as stakeholder analysis, stakeholder engagement plans, and stakeholder communication strategies. 
She explains how these tools can be used to facilitate effective stakeholder management and ensure that stakeholders are kept informed and engaged throughout the project. Mulcahy also discusses the role of cultural and organizational factors in stakeholder management, emphasizing the importance of adapting stakeholder management strategies to suit the needs of different stakeholders. The chapter concludes with a set of practice questions that reflect the types of stakeholder management questions found on the PMP exam. Mulcahy's detailed explanations of the correct answers help readers understand the underlying principles of stakeholder management and how to apply them in real-world scenarios. Chapter 13, Exam Strategies and Tips In the final chapter of PMP Exam Prep, Mulcahy shifts her focus from the content of the PMP exam to strategies for success. This chapter is packed with practical tips and techniques for maximizing exam performance, from time management strategies to test-taking techniques. Mulcahy emphasizes the importance of understanding the PMI mindset and offers advice on how to approach different types of questions, such as situational, formula-based, and knowledge-based questions. One of the highlights of this chapter is Mulcahy's discussion of common pitfalls and mistakes that candidates make on the PMP exam. She provides valuable advice on how to avoid these pitfalls and stay focused and confident during the exam. The chapter also includes a comprehensive set of practice questions, complete with detailed explanations of the correct answers, to help readers test their knowledge and build confidence in their exam-taking abilities. Strengths and Unique Features of the Book One of the most significant strengths of PMP exam prep is its ability to break down complex concepts into digestible, easy-to-understand explanations. Mulcahy's approach to teaching is not just about rote learning, she emphasizes understanding the why behind each concept, which helps readers apply the knowledge in real-world situations. Another unique feature of the book is its focus on rapid learning techniques. Mulcahy recognizes that many PMP candidates are busy professionals with limited time to study, so she offers strategies to learn quickly and efficiently. Her advice on creating a personalized study plan, coupled with her rapid learning techniques, makes the book accessible to a wide range of learners. Mulcahy's book is also known for its comprehensive practice questions and detailed explanations. These questions are designed to mimic the style and difficulty of those found on the PMP exam, giving readers a realistic preview of what to expect on exam day. The explanations provided for each question help reinforce learning and clarify any misunderstandings, making it an invaluable resource for exam preparation. Moreover, the book's empathetic tone sets it apart from other PMP exam prep materials. Mulcahy's understanding of the emotional and psychological challenges associated with preparing for the PMP exam is evident throughout the book. She provides encouragement and support making the reader feel confident and motivated to succeed. Impact on PMP Exam Preparation Since its release, PMP Exam Prep by Rita Mulcahy has had a profound impact on PMP exam preparation. It has become the go-to resource for thousands of candidates around the world, helping them pass the exam on their first try. The book's success can be attributed to its comprehensive coverage of the exam content, its effective teaching methods, and its focus on practical, real-world application of project management principles. Many PMP candidates have praised the book for its clarity, organization, and depth of information. Mulcahy's ability to make complex concepts accessible and her focus on understanding rather than memorization have been particularly appreciated by readers. The book's practice questions and exam strategies have also been cited as key factors in helping candidates pass the exam with confidence. In addition to its impact on individual candidates, PMP exam prep has also influenced the way PMP exam preparation is approached in the industry. The book's emphasis on understanding the PMI mindset, its use of real-world examples, and its focus on rapid learning have set a new standard for PMP exam prep materials. Comparison with other PMP exam prep resources When compared to other PMP exam prep resources, PMP Exam Prep by Rita Mulcahy stands out for its comprehensive coverage, practical approach, and focus on rapid learning. While there are many other PMP Exam Prep books on the market, few offer the same level of detail and depth of information as Mulcahy's book. 
One of the key differences between Mulcahy's book and other resources is its focus on understanding rather than memorization. While many other exam prep books focus on rote learning and memorization of formulas and definitions, Mulcahy emphasizes the importance of understanding the underlying principles of project management and how to apply them in real-world scenarios. This approach not only helps candidates pass the exam, but also equips them with the knowledge and skills needed to succeed in their careers as project managers. Another distinguishing feature of PMP exam prep is its rapid learning techniques. Mulcahy recognizes that many PMP candidates are busy professionals with limited time to study, so she offers strategies to learn quickly and efficiently. This makes the book accessible to a wide range of learners, from those who are just starting their PMP exam preparation to those who need a quick refresher before the exam. While other PMP exam prep books may offer similar content and practice questions, Mulcahy's book is unique in its empathetic tone and focus on the emotional and psychological challenges of preparing for the PMP exam. Her encouragement and support throughout the book make it a comforting and motivating resource for candidates who may be feeling overwhelmed or anxious about the exam. Conclusion Why PMP Exam Prep is a Must-Have for PMP Candidates In conclusion, PMP Exam Prep, Rapid Learning to Pass PMI's PMP Exam on Your First Try by Rita Mulcahy, is an invaluable resource for anyone preparing for the PMP exam. Its comprehensive coverage, practical approach, and focus on rapid learning make it an essential tool for success. Whether you're a seasoned project manager or new to the field, this book will provide you with the knowledge, skills, and confidence needed to pass the PMP exam and excel in your career. Mulcahy's unique approach to teaching, coupled with her extensive experience as a project manager, sets this book apart from other exam prep resources. Her emphasis on understanding rather than memorization, her practical advice, and her empathetic tone make this book a must-have for any PMP candidate. The impact of PMP exam prep on PMP exam preparation cannot be overstated. It has helped thousands of candidates pass the exam on their first try and has set a new standard for PMP exam prep materials. If you're serious about passing the PMP exam and advancing your career in project management, PMP Exam Prep by Rita Mulcahy is the book for you. Please read the book to learn more and consider subscribing to support the channel. Thank you.